I don't know texture. Don't ask me. Yeah, that was a good take. It's me. It's me. You're probably wondering, where am I? Um, I moved, so. I'm gonna give you guys a tour of my new apartment. We, Cameron and I just moved last week. Um, what day is it? I think the 8th. And I know I haven't came out with a video, but that's because <laughs> we've been moving and adjusting to our new lives. So Cameron started work yesterday after Labor Day. And so far, I really love the community. If you guys don't know, um, we moved to Chicago. So um, that's really exciting. Chicago has been a place that I've wanted to live in for a really long time, probably since like, maybe like early high school. We're still adjusting and um, I'm really happy that we moved. I don't really know what else to say. I just wanted to give you guys a video update and um, show you around the place. We're still like kind of packed, but like kind of unpacked. I mean, it's been like a week since we moved in, so we're probably not gonna be fully unpacked until like a month from now, because um, we still need to get like shelves and like furniture. And since we are living in a studio apartment, um, it's very small. So we might end up getting like a Murphy bed or, you know, like a bed that like goes up like on the wall, like here's a picture. And uh, something to put the TV on. I don't know if we'll mount it. We might get a new TV. I don't know, girl. But I remember when we first came in, it was literally just like, number one, this place is hella small. I mean, like we saw it, we had like a walk through like on FaceTime, but it was just like, girl, like that shit is small as fuck. Um, but at least the rent's not, the rent, we can pay the rent, so that's pretty good. <laughs> and also, it's literally, like, I was thinking, I was like, we did it. Like, we moved to Chicago, like, this is the beginning of our lives, you know, like, in a way. Like, I just feel so happy and grateful, and I really enjoy living here so far. Um, we went clubbing and everything the last few days. And I didn't record any of it because I just wanted us to kind of be together like in the moment. As we like adjust to the city life, I really wanted us to just enjoy like kind of at least being kind of touristy for like the last week, like the week before we have to like start working and stuff like that. So I'm just really looking forward to our new lives here. And I really think everything's just gonna like expand like, my YouTube channel is going to expand, but well, I'll be uploading. <laughs> and um, I just feel like... Okay, sorry, I can hear my neighbor. <laughs> I just feel like everything is just like going to expand, like, starting now. And it just feels great. I feel free. You know, we really... Cameron and I both love Chicago, and we've always wanted to stay here, like I said. So it's just, like, super dope. And... Yeah, so I guess I'll just show you the place. Our tiny little place is not much, but um, let's just do it now. Yeah. Also, I just want to say I've been playing a, a shit ton of Superstar SM because um, I spend a lot of my days just chilling right now. And um, yeah, I just wanted to say that because um, maybe I'll do like live streams and stuff of Superstar SM. If you guys don't know, it's like a rhythm tap game. Okay, whatever. Let's start. So first, when you come in, you have my feet with no pants on. Ooh, that's hot. Don't demonetize me. And uh, hold on, let me like, ooh, yeah. <laughs> I love having an iPhone. Okay, so <laughs> basically, um, that's my underwear. Please don't look at that. So you walk in, there's Door. It's all cute, a little garbage can, my wing stop. Walk in, here's our kitchen. We got our vodka because we're in our 20s. So like, of course we are going to have that. Um, we have this counter stove top kind of thing. It's not really like an actual stove, but like you get the vibes. Um, our garbage can is under here with like all of our Swiffer stuff. I like that the floors are 
was this wood it's probably not like real wood or maybe it is because it's like i think it is whatever okay and um this is our kitchen so it's very small like i said i have a scrubbing mommy right there scrubbing mommy and this is a convection oven convection that's what it says convection and uh yeah it's like shiny and shiny's bad okay then i have chicken breasts right here chicken titty an unwashed bowl that i used to make brownies like two nights ago and my keurig so these are just things that we have like from the old place we haven't really bought anything yet except for like necessities like cleaning products and stuff so here's all the internet cords and towels and um this is our itty bitty little fridge and on top is my nutribullet say hi nutribullet my Nutribullet is Korean, by the way. And this crock pot that my mom bought me last year. Shout out to mom. I know you're watching this. Next is, like I said, this. So these are actually these three random white children are our friend Amy's kids. So yeah, thing one, thing two, and thing three. And I have Charlie XCX albums magnets that I bought off of Mercari. So I just decided that each one of her kids has a favorite Charlie XCX album. And um, these are the ones that just match their personality. So for sure. Uh, yeah. And here's a clip for like, I don't know. I'll put it on the phone. Ooh, now I'm pulling up the phone. Ooh, oh shit. Wow, ain't nothing in here. There was a Halo top. I like Halo ice cream. And uh, yeah. Oh my gosh, guys. I just tried this the other day. Girl, let me show you this. Oh my gosh, so good. So I'm doing keto and basically like doing zero sugar. And I'm not really a pop drinker, but lately like I've been drinking like Diet Dr. Pepper and stuff because it has like zero carbs or whatever. But this Dr. Pepper cherry, I love cherry, like Coke, cherry flavored, like drinks and stuff like that. And this is literally like, so good like oh my god girl Ooh. and here is my god what is this called again oh yeah my cold brew thing i love making cold brew and putting it in my starbucks walt disney world cup because i'm a basic bitch like that but i don't give a fuck i made these brownies the other day do you guys want some i would gladly give them to you and um i didn't show you this but it's cameron's cameron's fruit rounds um, yeah, I don't eat generic cereal, so. Oh, and here's my, here's our AC. It's small, it's tiny. It definitely does the job very quickly because obviously the room is very small. So now we can move on to this area. <laughs> this is like basically the suitcase we've been living out of since Lollapalooza. And it has like obviously a shit ton of stuff in it. This is like something that Cameron got from his job from Staples. But you can see we have our Xbox right here. Hey, also here's my Crocs. Cameron doesn't want me to use his Crocs anymore because um, I get them really dirty. But I feel like he should just deal with it, you know? Okay, this is gonna work for real. This is gonna work for real. Okay guys, sorry I had to delete like a shit ton of stuff off my phone <laughs> because I still have videos from August on there so I had to delete them. Alright, so this is my bed like I said, um, a lot of magic happens on here, wink wink nudge nudge and uh, the windows over there and it's just cute and everything's great. So I'm just trying to find like stuff that's like good for small areas, small living and when we're able to move out we can like move into a bigger place but i think this is a good starter place honestly i just want to do it properly um i want to have like safe space space saving things and i found a few online that i'm planning on buying so i'm really excited about that you know i always love buying different stuff and i'm also thinking about putting like floating shelves like in this area so that we can put like our 
mo well, <laughs> mostly my like albums and collectibles because of my K-pop albums. I want to put like my Blackpink vinyl and all the Blackpink stuff I have and things like that. So yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I probably look so ridiculous. Wait, I need to go to the bathroom. I need to show you guys the bathroom. Okay, so this door leads into our kind of closet space. This area is being taken up by a bunch of our stuff. Honestly, most of this stuff is like, like this is linen. This is clothes. Um, I was thinking of having like two like a like one or two like huge drawers in here so that we can put both our clothes in um and just you know we can hang stuff up here we can probably throw out like one or two of those baskets both of those maybe and um yeah so we're just adjusting it's not really that much stuff it took us probably like less than two hours to put all the stuff in here with me cameron and our friend so it was a quick and easy move. We had the U-Haul, we got a small one and it was just like, whatever. So here's my bathroom stuff kind of. I'm gonna show you the bathroom in a second, but I wanna show you my favorite pads ever. This is not sponsored, but um, I would like to work with them eventually. This is L Brands Chlorine Free Ultra Thin Pads. And they are literally like, 100% cotton, like certified organic or whatever. What is it? Yeah, like certified corporation. And like they pay their workers like good and stuff. Um, and these are basically like their um, huge pads, like overnight pads. Because sometimes like I just don't feel like wearing tampons. It's not that I'm afraid of tampons. I just don't feel like wearing them all the time. They're really good. And um, they're like natural. And not just because they're natural, but like they literally feel like a cloud on your vagina literally a cloud on your cooch all right finally <laughs> this is el baño Ta-da! i love i love like cat my feet so here i am Ooh. <laughs> yeah all right so this is the mirror obviously and it divides up into three parts which is kind of weird so this is my side cameron the stab is this this is my side this is the stuff we both use <laughs> and this is his side <laughs> i love that like this is so hilarious and obviously it's like a pretty small space like everything else so if you guys have any ideas for like savers like space saving crap let me know Here's our toilet, it's clean, we love that. And um, really proud of this purchase. This is a toilet wand and uh, whatchamacallit from Target. So it looks really pretty even though like it's next to your shit. I want everything to be pretty, I don't care if it's next to my poop. So this is my towel, <laughs> don't look at it, it's dingy. And this is Cameron's towel, of course, it's cause it's red. And um, Cameron likes to because we don't really have like hangers for anything in the tub. Um, so we're probably gonna get something to like put right here, like one of those, whatever, the things from Target, it's right here. And we're probably gonna get one of those. And um, we just got this from Target or something like real quick. And those are his towels. So he doesn't really have anywhere to hang them. So he just does it right there. Oh yeah, and we had nowhere else to put the, <laughs> We had nowhere else to put the paper towels, so we have to put them like on top of the toilet. Because if we put them right here, they will literally just like fall off because they're like that. And it's like, you know, whatever. I don't know texture. Don't ask me. Okay, wait, my face is all fucked up. I'll do that again. I don't know texture. Don't ask me. Yeah, that was a good take. Okay guys, so that is it for this video. <laughs> if you wanna see more of me, you know what to do. And I love you so much. I'll see you in the next video. Follow me on my stuff and um, okay, thanks, bye. <laughs>